cattle decapitation. Sick. So, I'm not talking about cattle mutilations, which a lot of you might think that's where I was going with this. But this video has nothing to do with aliens or conspiracies for the first time ever. I'm switching it up and I'm talking about my other love, death metal. Inquire within. Inquire within. Inquire within. Reveal the UFO cover up. Revealing the entire UFO cover up. Okay, they're going to they're going to reveal it one song at a time. You dig? They're sending all the fans who sign up for a mail list a stack of real fucking government UFO files. It's powerful when you stay active and civil. You don't give up. Don't give up on making the life that you want to see. For your safety, put on the tinfoil hat. Today, Cattle Decapitation put out their first new song in about like four years or something like that. It's going to be on their new album, Death Atlas, and the song is One Day Closer to the End of the World. It is sick. It's got... It's like a good summary, I think, of everything that they do style-wise. It's got the crazy gravity and blast beats. Travis Ryan does his insanely unique clean vocals and screams. It says clean vocals. To me, it's not... They're not like clean vocals, even though that's what they are. It's singing. It's not screaming. It's like a weird hybrid of pitch screaming and singing but closer on the singing side it confuses me how he does it but it's sick and so if you don't know who cattle decapitation is they started in uh, 96 and a lot of their lyrics and content are a lot of animal rights a lot of environmental stuff uh, they go off of the theme a lot of humans being animals switching the rules roles of a lot of abuses and you know shitty stuff that happens to animals and the planet happening to us which in a big global cosmic universal scheme of things man we're all we're all one so what is happening to us I remember seeing on the news that there was a couple Native American teens where I forget where they were at, but just because they were quiet dudes and they were wearing dark clothing, people called the police on them. They got scared of them and they were wearing cattle decapitation shirts. And so cattle decapitation gave them lifetime free tickets good on you cattle decap so this next album death atlas it's coming out on november 29th definitely going to be pre-ordering that one and then the key is you gotta still buy the albums even though we got streaming because buying albums still does good for some bands maybe not monetarily but when it comes to setting up their tours and their positioning on festivals stuff like that it can still play a role so it's still important to buy the music but after you buy it don't listen to it from where you bought it stream it so then you send those little uh, eighths of a penny over to them you know hook them up a little bit better so I don't know what the rules are necessarily on YouTube for playing other people's music. And I really hope that uh, Metal Blade doesn't do the whole DMCA whatever takedown of this video. Especially because our song just came out today. I'm just going to play the last little bit of it. Uh, it's uh, just yeah, the last section of where Travis is doing his cleans. And when it goes back into the intense outro, so that way you can get like a real feel for the different styles that all the members of this band put into their music. So uh, it starts out at like 2.48. And then the lyrics, just for this section that you're about to hear, is one day we will all mean nothing. 
shallow graves to tomb the suffering and the pale horse's reins pulling my heartstrings. We walk alone from natility until mortality. We navigate lethality until fatality. Everything that's now living will one day meet its demise, out of breath, out of time, a species out of its mind. You gotta read the rest of these lyrics, or I'll post them in the description or something like that. It's dope. So, here is the last little section of one day closer to the end of the world. Okay, it's dope. So go pre-order it from metalblade.com or probably cattledecapitation.com. I don't know if they actually have a website called that, but I would assume so. So go get it. Okay, it's sick. Their album cover for this Death Atlas is dope as dopeness. So get it, all right? Oh uh, yeah, all right. So it's the first time not doing UFOs. I feel so weird. Love you. Subscribe to my mailing list for when I do UFO stuff again. Bye. So if you want to know about aliens and UFOs and the government covering it up, then Inquire Within is where your ass need to be at.